Well, the, what the lady is saying there is she's saying this is the proof, this is the proof they're holding up bits of what looked like, and what I've seen from what I've seen before, look like pieces of a cruise missile. It's hard for us to confirm exactly what sort of uh, weapon or missile this might be. It's also hard for us to confirm anything that we're being told about what this building was being used for. But certainly the people while we've been here have just gone inside the building, this lady pulling out more bits of debris. But what she's saying is, look at this, for them, this is proof this building was struck by some kind of a missile. Can I have a look? 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 Shoot. Okay. Okay. This is still warm. And the writing on it says, this equipment contains parts and assemblies sensitive to, to damage by electrostatic discharge, ESD. Precaution when using. And over here, it's hard to read. It looks like a serial number on the other side. Let's have a look over here. Control wires may be hard to know exactly what it is. I'm being shown something else over here. Heavy part of something. This is what people here are telling us, showing us is part of a missile system. And another part. Let me have a look at this. This is from the outside. I've certainly seen a few uh, cruise missiles before. This certainly has the look of a, of a weapon, of a missile about it. Again, I can't confirm exactly what it is. On this side, serial numbers seems to have been made on the 11th, on uh, November the 29th, 06. A serial number, but impossible to really know hello, what it is. Hello. So a lot of anger here that this building has been hit inside a compound that the Pentagon had earlier said wasn't a target. Hearing that from the government spokesman there. People very frustrated about why this is happening and apparently hitting targets that were, they'd understood, off limits. Frustration too, they say, because not long before this missile hit, an hour and a half before, they had re-announced their ceasefire. Nick Robertson, CNN, Tripoli, Libya.